Welcome to this week's late edition of Fighting Irish Extra, your fix for all Notre Dame athletics. We are here at the legendary Notre Dame Stadium. As you can see, they're getting ready for the 2012 Blue and Gold game, coming up next week. Whoa, ooh, okay. Ooh, uh, ooh. I you, apologize, you can't do that. I'm so sorry, I'm really, I'm really sorry. Um, this is Theoretic and Zygmata. Um, you guys want to help me host this week's fix? I think we can do that. We start things off for the week at Arlotta Stadium, where the women's lacrosse team hosted big conference foes. The Irish women were handed their second loss of the season on Thursday night, falling to the number three Syracuse Orange. However, they bounced back on Saturday as they crushed Villanova by a score of 18 to five. Nine Irish players scored in the game, and sophomore Lindsey Powell led the way with five goals. Freshman Allie Murray also notched her first career win in goal. There was also some big news for the team this week, as Notre Dame women's basketball star Brittany Mallory joined the team. Brittany was a high school All-American in lacrosse before joining the Irish basketball team, and she was added to the squad just one week after helping lead Muffet McGraw's team to its second consecutive national championship game. You know, the whole team was excited to have me, and uh, just the fact that I could help them out, hopefully, you know, do whatever I, they need, whatever I can do for them, and I'm just really excited to get back into it. Now let's grab our gloves and head back to the Diamond, where the softball team took action at Melissa Cook Stadium. Notre Dame built their win streak to seven with a five-inning win over Northwestern, the first against the Wildcats since 05. Freshman Katie Hulse led the way with two home runs in the first inning, and the Irish never looked back on their way to a 9-1 victory. On Thursday, the team continued their winning ways with the 8-6 win over another Big Ten foe at Purdue. Make sure to come out and support the Irish softballers this weekend as they look to strike out cancer while hosting Syracuse in a weekend series. A doubleheader kicks off Saturday at noon and the team will honor head coach Dina Gump's daughter Tatum with a silent auction and home run derby. All the proceeds go to Pediatric Oncology Clinic at Memorial Hospital. Finally, the baseball team continued their busy week with a midweek battle against Toledo. He did, and Jagailo takes it out of here. That's a way back in home run number six of the year. The Irish got back in the win column with a 7-3 decision against the Rockets. Junior Charlie Markson and sophomore first baseman Trey Mancini each knocked in two runs, and eight of the nine starters for Notre Dame got at least one hit. Notre Dame then traveled to Seton Hall for a weekend conference series, losing all three games in close decisions. That's it for this week's The Fix. Be sure to check us out next week for this weekend's highlights in sports. Also, be sure to like us on Facebook at Notre Dame Athletics and follow us on Twitter at UND underscore com. I'm Claire Cooney. I'm Zeke Mata. Theoretic. Go, Go Irish! Irish.